What is going on everybody? I got something really crazy cool to show you today. We just did a whole thing about the Mojo Tone Winder and how cool it was and unboxing it and stuff. And there is a company from Spain who I've actually been kind of keeping my eye on over the last few years because I've been seeing them develop a pickup winder. They hit me up last week and they said, I've got something, we've got something that I want you to check out. And so here it is. Well, let's go ahead and open the Tone Winder Ultimate CNC Winder together for the first time, because I actually have not opened this box yet. It comes in a really cool, I'm sure it's not a real Pelican case, but it's a generic version of such. Thanks for your order. Before we start winding, we should check tonewinder.es. And there is some list of all the parts it comes with. We got a power adapter, an adapter for single coils, a lifter for humbucker bobbins, a calibration magnet, I don't know what that means, an allen key set, bobbin screws, single coil screw, and a lint-free cleaning cloth. Sweet. All right. Well, your guess is as good as mine. All right, so we got a bunch of Allen keys for said adjustment. And looks like that must be a humbucker plate of some sort, and I don't know what that is. That's a lint-free cleaning cloth. I know what that is. We have an adapter for the power supply. We have an plug. Looks like we've got some, oh, tone winder. These to look to be 3D printed, um, like plates for adapting. That looks like a stylus of some sort. I saw that in the video. Some mounting thumb screws. Couple of different types. And this must be some other sort of winder plate plug deal. And that is another. Oh, that I wonder if that's for single coils. Not unlike what I have with my other one. Alright. Let's pull the foam out. Here it is. Sweet. Well, I'm gonna pull it out on the bench and let's, well, here, let's just leave it set like, just like that. And let's take a look. All right, so not unlike the other one that I have, it's got a gauss meter on the top. Looks like we've got a power button and a, it says, Factor, so I don't know what that means. All right, here, let's do this together. This is fun. So, as far as I understand, this is a touch screen, and that is what the stylus is for. You're supposed to wear super cool looking safety glasses, and it looks like you're supposed to shave your head also before you start using this thing. Um, looks like we got some other packing foam. I'm not going to remove that until I read some directions. All right, so here's the business end of the winder. We've got a bunch of different mounting points to make it, I would assume, universal for various things. Don't put your hand in there. Uh, this is not turntables and a microphone, so that's what I think that says. Um, and then we've got some pulleys. Now the way I understand this to work is your wire will come up off of your spool. This right here will keep your tension on your wire. This will, uh, your wire will go through here somehow. I, I saw a video that kind of gave me an idea about how that goes through there like so. I would assume that foam comes out because this is actually some sort of stepper motor that moves the traverse back and forth for you. 
And then of course this guy's going to be the one that spins and makes it go. So that's the unboxing experience. I should go ahead and plug it in and let's power it up. Plugged in. There's a USB-C cable on the back too. I think that has to do with firmware update stuff. All right, so I don't know what any of this does. So I'm just literally gonna hit the power button. I just wanna see what the display looks like. Oh. like a whole disco show. So what we've got here is a carbon fiber rod on some sort of stepper motor and it cycled through something. Start. New bobbin. Wow, this thing's neato, man. Oh man, I'm stoked. Well, I'm gonna go read some directions and we'll see what we can see. Oh, one other thing I want to show you. So they actually have two different models of this pickup winder and they sent me both of them. So I actually have two of these things and this is the other one. This is the less expensive version and you'll see here that it only has um, a spindle so it does not have the whole thing with the tensioner and the other tensioner thing now what i do know is that at 600 bucks or so that this thing costs i can't remember you'll have to check the website to be sure but you can buy an upgrade kit if you so choose at some point to add the parts to this one to make it the auto winder like the other one is. Like I said, I will read some directions and look into this thing a little bit more. Uh, and we will have full reviews on both machines, probably different because they are different and you use them differently, I would assume. But I am very interested to dive into the features and see how this thing works. So anyway, there you go. There's a little quick video unboxing a new thing. Thanks for hanging out. We'll see you in the next video.